Hi there, students. What's the difference between judicious and discerning? This one's for slow sunset vibes. OK, so let's see. Judicious and discerning. These are both adjectives. To discern as a verb. Discerningly, undiscerning. Uh, an adverb and an adjective. Judiciously, an adverb. OK, let's see. Discerning talks about being able to tell what is good, being able to decide what is good, um, to have good insight, um, to be perceptive about things, to be able to tell the difference between what's OK and what's really good. And judicious, this talks about being prudent, being careful, being practical. OK, so uh, let's see. I would say judicious, um, prudent, whereas discerning, able to tell the difference. OK, so for example, um, we need to spend our money judiciously. We want to be careful with it. We don't want to spend it on any things that we don't want. We need to spend our money discerningly. We need to get good value for money. OK, we need to buy the best that we can with the money that's available. So if you're discerning, you know uh, or you're good at choosing what is better, what is best, what is the best value for money. Um, OK, so judicious. It's something that you do with good judgment. You're wise, you're sensible. Yeah, it's astute and shrewd. Whereas discerning, this gives the idea of you're very selective. You've got good taste. You can discriminate the good from the really, really, really good. You can perceive the difference. You can pick out what is the best. OK, and this is the idea, I think, the main idea of discerning. Um, OK, so discer discerning is ta uh, talking about finding good things. So um, uh, he is, uh, when it comes to restaurants, he is very discerning. He is able to, to choose which are the best. Yeah, which ha are the best quality or the best quality for money? If I say when it comes to restaurants, he's judicious, it, that gives the idea that he doesn't go to very expensive restaurants. He's careful. He's careful with his, uh, his, his money. Um, when in doubt, he would rather say no. Yeah, I think if somebody's discerning that they are not in doubt, they know which is, which, which is the right one. But if you're judicious, you, you are being on the safe side. So if you're discerning, you have insight and understanding. You can discriminate between um, different qualities. Whereas if you're um, judicious, you are... Um, careful about things. So judicious management of money. We need to be judicious in our use of electricity. Yeah, I wouldn't use discerning that in, in that case. Um, so uh, a judicious selection process where you're careful, whereas a discerning selection process, you choose only the best. OK, so if a decision is judicious, you, you, you're saying it's a good thing because um, you, you, it, it, it's ca careful and it makes sense. It's considered, it's reasonable, it's sensible. Whereas discerning, the, a discerning reader will know the difference between a good book and a bad book. Yeah, a um, the discerning eye can tell the difference in qualities. Yeah, you're able to judge things. Yeah, and decide which are good and bad, and 
that's the the ma main difference yeah he discerningly chose the best he judiciously chose the best value for money or he judiciously chose the cheapest one okay so th that gives you the idea um let's see judicious and discerning formality mm, i'm going to give them i think 6.5 Use them in a semi-formal conversation, semi-formal or formal writing, but don't use them informally. And then as to origin, um, judicious comes through French from Latin, judicio, um, to judge, yeah, uh, judex, a judge. Um, so it's talking about judgment, whereas um, discerning comes from discernere, um, to distinguish, to dis divide, to decide, dis, apart, and senere, um, to separate. So, to separate apart, discern, separate the wheat from the chaff. Judicious, judge with good common sense. So enough, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Judicious or discerning?